Hello. I would like to show you a quick and dirty method of uh, ripening tomatoes. So, let me show you. Uh, I use a bucket for the trimmings. I use a pair of trimmers. And, of course, we need tomatoes. So, as you can see, in this tomato plant right here, see, you need to trim all the extra foliage because, you know, it's the end of the season and most likely you're not going to get, you know, like, uh, you know, the small, real, the very, very small tomatoes, they're not going to ripen. But the ones that you have already there, what you can do is you can trim all the extra um, flowers and branches and give as much energy as you can to the few tomatoes that you have left. So you see this one too. See this branch for the most part, most part is dead. So what you have, you have the tomato plant trying to send in energy to these uh, branches. It's going to go in the mulch pile. So what you need to do is you need to trim all the extra branches and just let the branches that have the few tomatoes, the few green tomatoes. You see here's another branch. See? It's not doing anything. I'm just going to trim it right there. And it's going to go in the mulch pile. See? You see I've done it here. See there. So this branch here, it's not necessary. It's not doing anything. And it's a shame for the tomato plant to send energy to, you know, for the, to this plant, to this branch, when it's really not necessary. So, so here's another example. Here I have a couple of tomatoes. This started to ripen, but it's still green. See, we have all these extra branches here. They're not doing anything. So we'll get rid of them. And we're going to send energy directly to the tomatoes that need the energy so they will ripen. So let's see. Yeah, this one too. And this branch, it's not necessary, it's not doing anything. About a month and a half ago we went on vacation and the plants grew uh, and I wasn't here to you know direct them properly and this one went a little bit off to the side and we put a chair here to support the, 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 the tomatoes. And, uh, This one too. See, it's the end of the season. The branches started to dry off, but uh, we need to be a little bit proactive and trim as much as we can. So the plant will send energy to the, the area where it's needed the most, the, the green tomatoes. So here you go again, you see this, it's not needed, it's extra. So here we go. So. Trim as much as we can without destroying the whole plant. So here's the one branch. You see, it has one little tomato near the end. And I'm going to trim this little branch there. Well, I hope this helps, folks.
you have tomatoes that you want to ripen quickly, just follow this quick method and you will be fine. And here's another example. We have this branch that has a couple of little tomatoes over there. But the rest of the, the, the branch is not doing anything. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut it there. And now the tomato will have, will send energy to that uh, the, the last part of the branch. The branch is not going to waste energy, you know, just keeping it nice and green. So it's the same thing here. See, there are a couple of branches here that I can cut. They're not doing anything. And I'm going to go right into the bucket. We will go into the mulch pile. Same thing here. See, we have this branch that goes all the way here. This is full of little cherry tomatoes. So this is not doing anything. Into the bucket. So let's see, right here. See, it has a couple of, a few tomatoes here. Oh, there's a little flower here, but you know, we're in the middle of September. This ain't never gonna make it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna cut it right here. So I'm going to give a chance to these little green cherry tomatoes to grow. And so same thing here, you see this branch, there are a few cherry tomatoes. I'm just going to give them extra energy by cutting it here and there. Mmm, look at this cherry tomato right here. It has my name on it. Mmm, yummy. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Alright, that's enough for now. <laughs>